So this week in my um, cash envelope spend um, was a bit different. I had a lot of things come up and we had a few extra things like the toy sale and all that. So I had to um, juggle it around um, to fit that all in. So um, last week I think I had 85 left and I spent 33 on veggies and stuff. And then Tyler's medicine I believe was 16 so then I had the leftovers of that, whatever that is, I can't remember. Um, and then I allocated $200 for the toy sale, um, some to put a lay-by on and some to purchase a few things. So I spent 219 so it wasn't too bad, but I got everything that I wanted. I think I got two or three things for each kid for Christmas and a few things, two things for Zoe's birthday and something else. Um, that I brought uh, so yeah so that was pretty good then it left me with $70 for fuel which I spent $55 just under 55 I think no exactly 55 funnily enough um, and then the kids had youth group which is $12 um, that's almost every week they go to two different ones so that was in it um i haven't got it written down so i probably should have and then i had around 150 170 for food no i think it was 150 left for food and um other stuff and i spent 159 so i did go over this week but i'm not too stressed about it um food is probably one thing that if i go over i go over we have to eat but then i only allocated 150 so um it's not too bad uh, so yeah so that was it so here is what I got this week in the groceries it's pretty small because I have heaps left so um, I'm going to use that up and um, yeah I use some of the pocket money for other things which I'll explain a bit later so here we go so we got um, lamingtons for snacks and then wafer biscuits and they had these so I thought I'd try them on sale then all our milk tuna to make tuna pasta stuff formula uh, baked beans corn that goes in the tuna pasta um, chicken burgers we're having tonight and then a block of cheese you know I think I'll need another one potatoes I was going to do um, baked potatoes uh, in the slow cooker and chili con carne tomorrow night but I just realized now um, slow cooker died a few weeks ago so i won't be able to do that um then i got lettuce for the burgers tonight pears apples um nappies ritz biscuits and these are for the burgers tonight and um more nappies so they're pull-ups those ones and they're nappies so that's all the shop this week and that came to 159 dollars and 70 cents so this week we are having to alter our budget we're changing so fuel has its own allocation of money and then food has its own allocation or food like everything else has its own allocation in one i might split it again i just found that i kept forgetting that i need to put fuel in my car and we'd be like oh i hope you make it <laughs> um so yeah uh we've done that so we split it to i get 70 for food for fuel and 350 for um, food in uh, next week's um, cash envelope um, spend. So ours goes up and down for those that don't know um, because of Eric's work and we have really inconsistent income. So some weeks we only have 150, other weeks we have, you know, five or six hundred dollars. So, but it all works out in the end. I think on average I spend around the 300 mark. Um, if I was to average it for a whole year uh, on food so yeah so that's 
that's it for this week thanks guys like subscribe and comment below bye Say bye. Bye. bye.